Let's talk about COVID now. The China's COVID crisis has refreshed horrific memories of the pandemic. Local reports say that long lines could be seen at crematorium in the nation's capital as healthcare nears collapse with the recent surge in cases. China relaxed its controversial zero COVID policy last month, leading to a spike in infections as a fallout of which funeral homes and crematoriums across Beijing are reportedly struggling to keep up with rising demand for memorial services. Infections among workers and drivers in the sector are also on a rise. Now, these reports come after a U.S.-based research institute recently said an explosion of China's cases is expected this week and over a million people in the country could die of COVID in 2023. That's next year. However, Chinese news outlet Kaixin has reported deaths after the policy was reformed. Deaths included outlets' own journalists. Even news agencies reported journalists witnessing about more than a dozen corpses that awaited cremation in the capital. However, it was not clear if the deaths were due to COVID. China, on the other hand, has not reported any official death since December 7th, since it eased its strict zero COVID policy. The Chinese capital, Beijing, last reported a fatality on November 23rd. China's official infection tally has meanwhile become unreliable after officials eased mandatory COVID testing rules. The lack of official data on COVID deaths has now stirred debate on social media in China as people seek to learn true statistics. Weon is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.